Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this social media post animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So vectors from freepick.com, I will add download link and project files. Firstly, let's select this layers plant. Let's see. Okay, let's write mouse, break homes, add name, plants, click OK. And back to main composition. Then let's create new null object for fake camera effect. Right mouse, new and null object. And change name, camera fake. Then for move to anchor point center, hold control, double click, palm behind icon. Then click selection tool and select all these layers. Let's link to camera fake null object. Okay, in this time, go to text and let's write here shopping day and click selection tool. Go to effect presets, search effect drop shadow. Select drop shadow, let's use for this text and change distance. Okay, nice. So let's move the center like this and select this text, link to also null object camera and move it up like this. Then select this camera, let's press P and move it up like this. Okay, and in this time select this shopping, press P, move it up and select this background. Let's press P and move it up. Let's change scale like this. Okay, and look layer and select this background shape layers. Also move to up. Okay, nice. So in this time, make new passing keyframe frame for camera and go to here, fave keyframes, frames and move to down like this. Select shape frames, make easy, easy. Go to graph editor, select this graph. Let's make smooth shape frames. Okay, back to shape frames and select last shape frame, move to right. And select this camera shape frames, let's move to right also. Then go to window, open Animation Composer 3. This plugin is free. And you can watch my video how to download and how to install Animation Composer 3. So open starter preset and open text here, animate characters and let's select any effect for text animation okay this is good, let's when we select the text layer go to here, click in let's see okay not bad so let's close window and select this mark move right for slow animation let's see okay nice so let's go to here and Select these background shape layers. Let's control D and move it down like this. Again, control D and move it down. Okay, nice. Let's say again. Okay, not bad. And in this time, let's select these plants and back layers. Let's move it down. Okay. So let's see. Nice. So in this time, select this back one, back two, and back three. Let's go to here and let's link to plants. Select plants and press S, change scale. Let's move to here like this. Okay, nice. And select the backs and let's link to camera fake. Let's see. Okay, very nice. And select these plants. Let's move to behind back one. And select these back layers. Let's go to here. And press P. Make new passing keyframe. frame. Move to right. And select the back three. Let's move to down. Select back two, move to left, and back one, move to right. 
let's see okay and let's select keyframes make easies go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph let's see okay nice let's back to shape frames and select these layers move to left and select this camera let's press p select passing shape frames go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph and back to shape frames select this last shape frame move to right for slow animation okay very nice and select these all shape frames let's move to left okay very nice let's select shape frame and move to left okay nice so let's open plants and let's select this plant go to palm behind icon and move to anchor point here click session tool select this plant 7 let's go to solo and move to anchor point down click session tool and plant six make someone and plant five move to right anchor point and plant four and plant three and plant two and finally plant one okay so click session tool and unsolo then select this plant eight go to first second let's press air and make rotation shape frame and change 15 go to 10 shape frame change minus 7 again go 10 shape frame change 4 Again, go 10 J frame, change minus 2. Go 10 J frame, change 1. And go 10 J frame, change 0. So, this more J frames for bones effect. Let's select J frames, make easy. Let's see. Nice. And go to first second, select this. And hold shift press S, open scale. Make scale J frame. Let's move right. And change scale 0. Let's go to here. Let's try change 110, go to here, change 95, and go to here, change 100. Select shape frames, make easy. Let's see. Nice. So, select last three scale shape frames, let's move to right. Okay, that's good. Okay, so select shape frames, Control C for copy. And let's select all layers. Control V4 paste. Let's see. Nice. And let's select this layer 1 or layer 2, move to right. And layer 3, move to right. And like this for random animation. Let's see. Nice. And let's select this, move to right. Okay, very good. So, close plant compositions and let's see here. Okay, let's select plants and move to right. Move to left. Okay, nice. Let's see again. Okay, good. Let's try move to left again. Nice. So, let's select all layers and click for motion blur. Let's say again. Let's change quality quarter. Nice. Okay, so go to window, open again animation composer 3, open starter precoms, 
and let's click for shape elements and I want to use these lines for fogging let's select this, click add and let's see let's move to left okay nice, let's select this composition we can change this lines color here or I will use fill select this fill, let's use for this composition and change white and let's move to behind here let's move to right okay not bad so in this time select this background shapes and search effect wave warp select this wave warp, let's use for this background shape lift let's try change pinning all edge and change wave width and wave height let's see let's try change like this okay that's good and select wave warp effect control c and select this background shape control v go to here and select again this layers control v and this let's search which layer okay control v and this control v let's say again okay nice so let's select this fake camera go to last shape frame and let's try move it down like this okay nice okay very nice we can add text here also let's select this shape layer and move it up okay let's select this shopping day control d move to right and in this time we can see here let's press p and move it down okay nice we can add here our product name let's write here nijat products click session tool and move to here let's see nice so let's do full animation so thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck